Okay, um, back to what I was saying. Um, so yesterday I made my way through New Mexico. My brother texted me. He said, hey, what's up with the fires? Um, have you planned your route? And I'm like, no, I don't actually plan anything. That would be just be craziness, right? So he sends me a text to have a map with all the fires. I'm like, ah, okay, whatever. I didn't see any fires. I did see the remnants of a couple of forests that were gone. I did see firefighters. Um, however, those of us who want to camp and be left alone in the woods, the forest was closed. Yeah, the forest service roads were closed. No camping in, in New Mexico near Taos or any or Chama, anywhere like that where I wanted to go. So at this point, I'm like, oh, I'm getting tired. I've been driving all day. Um, hold on, there's a creeper van pulling up behind me. So, oh, they're living in their van. But probably more room than living in a Jeep. Um, so, I decided to go ahead and go to Pagosa Springs, Colorado, because that's one of my destinations that I wanted to be at. Uh, getting dark by this time, hungry, starting to get a headache. Um, just been on the road for, you know, bef by the time I stopped, it had been 13 hours. Um, and when I got to Pagosa Springs, it was dark. Uh, the towns in the mountains don't have a lot of chain stores. So there wasn't the Holiday Inn Express and the stuff you can just pull up on Expedia. And I did pull into a couple of motels, but they were all full. And I don't want to pay for a motel anyway. That's like completely out of my realm. Like th that's not the point of this trip. So I went to Walmart. By this time, a headache is full-blown migraine. Um, parked in the Walmart parking lot. Kind of concealed myself a little bit. Tried to get a little bit of sleep. Tried to fall asleep. Wasn't falling asleep. Headache was too bad. Um, so then I drove to a grocery to a, a filling station. Got some migraine medicine. Came back to Walmart. Because if you are following any bloggers or anything like that, then you know that Walmart will usually let you camp in their parking lot. Well, there's a big sign where I was that said, no overnight stay. So I'm like, well. So still had the migraine. Um, didn't stay. Drove for a little bit. By this time, it's dark, dark. And I don't know if my headlights are um, not correct. I'm not sure. Um, they're brand new. Um, but everybody kept flashing their lights at me like I had my high beams on. And I swear I didn't unless my high beam thing is just broken and stuck on because this is an older Jeep. But everybody was flashing their lights at me. I couldn't see. I just wanted to cry because my head hurt so bad. I finally pulled up in a um, McDonald's parking lot that was closed. Everything closed. Like these little towns, like there had nothing going on after 10, 11 o'clock at night. They roll up the streets. I finally parked in a parking lot um, behind a McDonald's in Pagosa Springs, and I slept for about four or five hours. The headache went away for the most part. It's still kind of lingering a little bit this morning, but much better. So when I woke up this morning, um, went back to Walmart and went to the bathroom, brushed my teeth, brushed my hair, and then I found a little spot out in the woods just now, was able to change my clothes, and feel like a brand new person so I'm not sure what the day holds just gonna go and see what uh what fun but even with all yesterday's tiredness and drama and um headache and just on and on and on when I woke up this morning I was like oh my god I'm here I'm in the mountains and it's so beautiful and it's 40 degrees and like this is where I love to be this is where I want to be so you know whatever happens today is just going to be amazing because it just is that's just the way my life is I get what I want um sometimes I'm glad my expectations are low <laughs> but anyway see you next time